What's going on, everybody? Eddie Soundhead back once again here with Soundhead Entertainment. We are back in Wreckfest once again here, and we are returning to Talladega, one of the all-time classic tracks here for the first time in 2020, if you can believe that. And what better way to come to Talladega than dressed as the Pied Piper? Just look at this beautiful ride that we have ready for us. Our chariot awaits here today as we're going to take on a little mini gauntlet here at Talladega with Dale Jr.'s final ride car tribute to his rookie car we're gonna get our heads kicked in here at Dega, so let's go ahead and get it started got old dale jr teammate right in front of us right from the start steve parks we'll give him a push if we can or i just dump him instead that works too down into turn one now of course where all the action usually takes place and it looks like it might be starting right on our outside watch out boys hold on to it i think they did but they're not going to right in front of us keep it low nope they're not gonna and they get launched the 30 another space force candidate right from the start we got one about to get hooked up here in front of us. The 19 off the front of the 44. We got some spooky invisible boys wrecking up at the front of the pack. Bunch of guys getting held up. We're going to get a huge run on the bottom. The packery taking place on the outside lane is holding everybody up. And we are going to launch our way past a bunch of them. I'm making this move on the outside. It's now or never. I'm getting to Jacker Jones. If he doesn't come up into me, I saw that. Come on, that was like a side draft gone wrong there. Oh, I'm gonna get nailed here. There it is, right on cue, and another for added measure. Beautiful, neat, wonderful, and grand. I blame Jagger wholeheartedly for this. Look at my car. Demolished, completely destroyed, like my hopes and dreams. I know social distancing is like the big thing right now, but we got a race to win. I got bump drafts to make, and I got JJ Illies to almost wreck. That could have been bad. That could have been real, real bad. Something's getting bad up there. Somebody just got T-Bone nailed. I'm running over the 28. A 28 had a rough start. He got landed on earlier. Oh my goodness, what a roll. The two is rolling like crazy. That poor guy, if he lives, he's gonna be sick for the rest of his life. After that, the G-Force must have been incredible. He's gonna be vomiting for the rest of eternity. And I might be too after what I'm seeing on my outside. These guys are trying to wreck on this straightaway. I am not trying to be a part of this. Oh, yeah, Jagger Jones looking like he's going to run Elliot Sadler up the track like he did to me. We got somebody rolling down the inside on their roof. We got Marcus Ambrose dumping Chase Elliott, and we're all going for a spin again. Oh, I just knew that was going to go poorly. Can't even get through the trioval without wrecking ourselves. Look at this side-by-side -side action up here. Oh, they're going to wreck each other. Oh, they're going to do it. Can I get by it without dying, please? I just want to live. Come on, let me gain a few spots here. I got a drag race with Texas Terry. He's got the draft help from behind, but it's not going to help him. The physics aren't there. Well, we'll steal eighth place. Kale Yarbrough, our arch nemesis, is going to get the win, so that's a bit tragic. Guess we can try the middle. I'm not a big fan of what I'm seeing up here in front of me. There goes the 29. There goes a lot of things. There goes me. Here we go, boys. Oh, we're out of it. We are tumbling. We stick the landing, but we are toast. Come on, Yaley, let's go with the push right here, son. Oh, man, all right. Yeah, maybe that's why they tell you not to push into the corners, but they're gonna wreck in the corners all the same. Look out, oh, man. That 11 was coming back up for me, but he got packed and it kind of straightened it back out. Very lucky right there. Got a little run on the inside down to the corner. Now got AJ Allmendinger up here. We got somebody sideways in front of the field. Just getting knocked out of the way. I mean, Elliot Sandler going down to the apron. I think we're going to be able to save it. Oh, my goodness. Somebody is getting just run down behind us as they flip over each other. Here comes the push dinger into the corner. Let's go. There's a couple wrecking up in front of us. Hard in the outside wall. What the hell was that? They hit the wall head on it. Just popped straight up in the air. That didn't make any sense. The physics book has just been completely disregarded at this point, I guess. We won't get the result. We were looking for, but we will at least get a result and get across the finish line alive, which is just a rarity here at Degas. So we'll happily take it. Oh, I don't like what I'm seeing up there at all. Here they come and they're right in front of me. Nowhere to go. Oh man, just got launched to Ken and we stick the landing. We are not even that badly damaged by the looks of it, at least externally. So I'm going to keep this thing rolling. Got cars just laying dead everywhere. Cars pulling up on the track while invisible. 
Thank you. I really appreciate it. There's still wrecking going on that we're not even involved in. I'm just trying to survive out here, and this is becoming a very difficult task, but we kind of expected this. Look at him, just laying there. Oh, look what? Oh, my goodness. Are you kidding me? Again, these guys, they have no shame. They'll take you on any way they please. No, don't do it again. You have to be kidding me. Oh, my God. There is actually an agenda against us, and Kale Yarbrough has won. If you don't believe this game is out to get me, I don't know what to tell you. Three wide in the middle is not wise, especially in turn one, and this is exactly why, right here. Case and point exhibit A through Z. And we're gonna come to a rest with a completely mangled car, and I think we lost. Why not throw one of these in here just for the giggles of it? Just to get one out of the way today. Oh my God. Goodness, how am I still alive? Will I survive the landing? I do, what the heck? Give him that push to JJ Ely up the track though. Oh, he's gonna come back down. He nearly hooks me. I'm gonna hook the 11 and he took the 28 in return. We're killing people by proxy and we've got cars going everywhere in front of us. Oh, but the gap opens up in the perfect spot to slide right through it. And there's all kinds of stuff going on behind this car. getting up on their side down the back stretch. We're gonna give a push to Jagger Jones here. We almost wrecked the three wide up here. We got Glenn Wood getting hooked in the corner up there. Look out. We're gonna make the move down to the bottom on Jagger here, and we are gonna creep our way up into fourth place. Got a big old run on Chase Elliott here in the trial. We're gonna sneak it down to that inside and get there. He's gonna keep coming down on me though. Like I'm not even there. What are you doing, Chase? Oh, and he kills the wall and he disappears. Oh my God, F in the chat for Chase Elliott. Look at Brett Moffat just limping it around here. Oh no, he got packed to death, no. Oh no, he's going to the wall, he's out of control. Well, we are gonna finish on the podium, but we're gonna finish behind Kale Yarbrough and Natalie Decker. So these are trying times indeed. See if we can take a shot through the middle here into the corner or not. JJ Yelly could just decide that's not gonna happen. Nearly murdered me right there. And we got more of them coming from the front. Oh my goodness, that can stop at any time now. We've only been through two corners, you know. Look at this absolute mess up in front of us. This is getting ugly fast. We got Invisible Boys getting knocked all around. Cars going everywhere. Cars flipping all around the track and we're gonna drive right through the middle of it. That was beautiful. Cars going everywhere back there. Got a nice little race to the finish, shaping up here. A couple cars going down the apron, coming back up, going back in the line of cars and taking them out of the front pack. We're gonna get a run on Natalie Decker. We'll get to second. And that is gonna leave us looking at Kale Yarbrough out the windshield. Not enough time to get to him. Man, he is really sticking it to us right now. He has been absolutely dominating us today. I don't know how many races he's won at this point, but it has been far too many. This is getting out of hand. We need to act fast. Taking the safe route, boys. I'm holding it down here on the bottom, letting him wreck it up top. Look at him up at the top. Somebody just flew over the pack of cars up there while being half invisible. It was Decker, and I'm gonna pack the 15 clean out of my way as there is, oh my goodness, absolute carnage unfolding behind us. Oh, we got a couple more cars getting out of line here. It's always turn one. The meme lives strong and it's taking off the pack. Some of them are gonna hold on to it up here, but we are gonna get a major run on these guys. They're all slowing down. Look at us, we're gonna catch the leader here. We're within a half a second. Look at this pass for the lead right here, boys. We are at the point. The glory will belong to us on this day as we are going to close the book on chapter one. Or I guess turn the page on chapter one. I don't know how you say these things. I, 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 we're getting the dub, all right? That's how I know to say these things. We have got the dub. Part one is complete, and we have got two more parts to go. So you better not go anywhere, or I will destroy you like I'm about to get destroyed in these replays that should hopefully be popping up on your screen right about now if I am worth a damn at editing, which I'm usually not. So bear with me for that. But we have got two more parts of this to go. Now, I mentioned we're doing a melee gauntlet at the beginning of this video. And now it's time for me to explain what we've got coming up next. So we've got the classic pinball mod coming in hot. We're gonna run it back 
do another Talladega challenge where we have to survive. And if we do collect a dub, then we're throwing in the low gravity mod and we're running it back again. And only then are we allowed to leave. We've re-arrived here at Talladega. The pinball mod is activated and we are ready to fly and most likely die. Give that shot right to my boy Brad in the get go. And here they go. Natalie Decker's moved to the 57 and she's going flying. The first victim of the day and then we are next. This has gone off the rails right from the start. Oh, I'm gonna get one more. Thank you. Thank you, Brad. That was Brad again, wasn't it? I think it was, yeah. Now, watch out. 88 in the way. 88 on 88 violence. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do that to you. Oh, we got a couple of them wrecking them up here again. Racing themselves. Can't keep themselves from wrecking going end over end back there, the Slim Jim guy. I don't know what happened, but the leaders are doing like two miles an hour. We're just gonna blow on by him and take it from him. That was easy. There we got my boy Brad Keselowski right there, putting him a lap down. Oh, Jerry Nader, what are you doing? No! Talk about a Terminator, dude! Oh, grand. Oh, you know what? Good. Oh, and it doesn't end! Gonna give a bump draft to Brad, and it did not work at all. All right, pinball drafting, not an option. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, oh yeah, there they go. Oh boy. Oh my goodness, how do we squeeze through the middle like that? Oh, there we go, it's over. It is all over. We packed and got packed and we're gonna land on the wheels and ride out of it. Man, talk about lucky, all right. Jesus, this thing's destroyed, but it keeps rolling. This car's laying down here at the end of the straightaway. Oh my goodness, somebody just got launched and I did too. Thank you, Greg Ghost. Ow. Heavily in the wall. Somebody else there met a much worse fate than I did. Excuse me, buddy. I got to get back over here. Paul Menard just passed for the lead. I can't allow that. Oh, he's going to pack whoever that is in the corner. He does. He blasts them. Oh, Paul, you big dummy. No, Paul, we can't have old. This car is not turning. The car does not turn well. We have got some serious damage down there. This thing is not feeling the corners right now, man. Okay. All right. I'm just gonna keep my foot to the floor, man. This is all right. Just doing a little case of cane. There we go. We get it back. Oh, keep it off the wall. Keep it going. Oh, no, that's not keeping it off the wall. It's all right. I think we can get it going. Back through the gears we go. Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, I lost the wheel. Oh, you hate to see it. Car's not budging. Cars are dying all around us. And we just lost the lead. Oh, what are you guys doing? You're just driving up into the high lanes. This is going to be huge. Oh, my God. Holy crap. What a series of packs. Oh, man, and a barrel rolled a boot. That was perfect. Oh, man, we got another pack up here. What is going on here? Look out, Cedric's coming back down the track. Right into us. Nowhere to go on that one. Come on. We can get it rolling back around here. We're... Get Cedric out of my face. Oh, that worked out well. All right. I launched him forward. He's driving back into the racing lane. He's going to get packed again. Look out for the five. Almost crunched us. Cindric is just trying to get packed by everybody. He's going back for more. Look at him. Oh, <laughs> no way. Cindric, what's wrong with you? Corey, why are you coming up the track, buddy? Not like you had three lanes down there or anything. Thank you for that. Really appreciate that one. Yeah, you freaking. Oh, boy. I got words for you. All right, I don't know what's happening to the leaders right now, but we are catching Denny Hamlin at a fairly rapid pace. He appears to be down here, maybe at the side of the track. Has he been blasted by somebody? I think somebody did the work on Denny Hamlin. Now he's gone. He is out of the top four. Denny Hamlin goes from leading the race to dead in the final corner of the final lap. How many times has that happened to us? Countless times. Do I feel bad for Denny Hamlin? Not even slightly. 
We're taking this dub. It's a big juicy one. We still got one more to go. I'll let you guys watch some replays of those last few runs while I set up the next one. All right, we are all set up and back here for round three of our mini gauntlet. We have got low gravity enabled with the pinball mod, so we're gonna die. I am very nervous for this three wide. It's not how I wanted to enter the first corner and there go the boys. They are getting launched. I just packed Tyler and Grumbo and we're getting launched too into the fence. We are wrecking big right off the bat and going into a barrel roll into the infield grass. This is a swimming start to our adventure here in Talladega. We're just gonna hit the reset button. Oh man, oh my goodness, we get absolutely clocked again, just as we were fading into reality. Back on the reset, we get knocked around again by the gray ghost. And now finally we're able to continue. Did they take this little jump out? Is it gone now? Oh, it's not gone. It is very much still there. We just lost the wheel. What a great experiment that was. I guess if we're gonna find out, why not now and not later? Here comes the converging of the lanes. Oh, and I'm crashing to the back of Dale Sr. And this is gonna be a bad one. We're in the fence. We are twisting and tumbling down the banking here in last place. Well beyond and well behind the rest of the fields crash. And actually we're in a dead tie for last with a destroyed car. Jimmy Johnson gonna fit in the hole right there somebody is getting absolutely launched up there and we get squeezed into a tumble and spinning like a top on our roof in the air and into the infield fence we are hitting all the fences here today and i am stuck up on the wall it's slipping down though come on there we go freedom is all mine we are able to continue, albeit we are in 22nd, which is pretty pathetic as that Wrangler car just got launched and I got clipped. And we're going spinning again as if we didn't have enough of that already. These drivers would be throwing up like crazy right now as somebody who's half invisible is just flipping end over end in front of us and going over the fence and into the infield. You know what, buddy? I can relate to that. We've been there many a time. We can relate. Oh, I got somebody. It's Dale Sr. I got to block Dale Sr. Come on, you're not going to intimidate me. Oh, all right. We held him off. Who's this? I got to return the favor. It's Marcus Sambros. Oh, that didn't work out well at all. That could not have gone worse. I think our closing rate was a bit too much for that to be successful. Everybody just got knocked off the track. Who's this? Is this Dale Sr.? Oh, no, I got to repay the favor to him now. Come on, we can do this. Oh, my God. What just happened? We just got sandwich packed. This is, uh, this is unprecedented. This is never before seen. I just got sandwich packed to the infield of Talladega, to the party. I'm, I'm at the boulevard now. Wow. What a scene. When are we gonna learn three why it doesn't work, people? This is why, this is precisely why I'm scared of it. This is a nightmare. I couldn't get off of that six car to save my life. And he's still riding the fence over there and he's sliding down the track. Watch out, go up, go down, dodge, left, right, up, down, down, all the buttons right now to try and miss everybody. And it's still not enough. It's still not even close to enough. And it never will be, but we will still try. Look at this. Are you seeing what I'm seeing right now? Low gravity, really a blessing that it's uh, not how we roll around here. Get it, get it how we roll. 
Look at the 288s flipping on the same screen. It's a beautiful sight. It really is. The Red Baron flying in his natural habitat. Brad Keselowski just going to dump him for the 19th time today. I don't know why I have it out for my favorite driver. Oh, oh I thought I was clear. I was not. Oh, my God. Danica Patrick is going for a ride. There is a lot to be said right now. Oh, my goodness. I just got smashed. Absolutely smashed. Me and Tony Stewart came together. And it ended well for nobody. Look at the front end of this thing. Oh, my. Jimmy Johnson once again using the highly experimental Hendrick Motorsports technology to go completely invisible. Exalta working on that one for next season. Uh, I just caused a three-car wreck at the back of the pack. We're not going to worry about that right now. Uh, all right, let's go ahead and worry about what we're about to see in front of us because it's going to get bad. Holy 19-car clean over everybody. This is a... Oh, that's terrible. That is a vicious T-bone. There are cars flying everywhere. My brain can't even comprehend what I'm seeing right now. There were so many different cars flying in so many different directions. That was nuts. Oh, look out. Clipping everybody, but we're still rolling. We're in the top five. Oh my God, somebody just got space forced. I don't even know how else to describe it. That might be the Lieutenant Space Commander or something. I don't know, that guy's got a high rank. He went flying. Who's pulling up the track right now, trying to take lives out here? That's not how we roll. Marcus Ambrose is out here. Is this him right here? And I'm gonna clip him. No, no, that was the leader. We took the lead while destroying him and on the way by destroying ourselves. That is passing for the lead with style. Well, I don't know what else to say. Utter domination in maybe its ugliest form. We are going to get across the finish line with style and grace. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. And I get pummeled afterwards for good measure and sent directly into a fence where I belong. What a day. What a day at Dega. What a day at the races. And what a day to dive 50 million times like we did. But it was all in the name of entertainment, fun, and celebration because we of course just recently hit 300,000 subscribers here on the Soundhead channel. That is absolutely amazing. You love to see it. You people are nuts. You people are insane. And you have all of my love and admiration. Thank you all so much for your incredible support. Really, it means more to me than I can even explain to you and put into words. It just, it, it means the world to me, especially in these times that we're living in right now that are just very bizarre. And I hope everybody out there is hanging in there and staying safe. We will get through this together. One wreck fest video at a time if we have to. I will be here standing guard, supplying the wreck fest destructive fulfillment that we all desire, cracking the occasional joke when I can, and trying to keep us all entertained as always. If that's what it takes, that's what we will happily do and we will get through this all together. So thank you everybody so much. I love you all. I hope you have a great weekend. And with that, I will leave you with some replays and see you all in the next one. Peace. Hey, you stuck around to the end. Thanks. I appreciate it. That's, uh, that's pretty cool. I didn't know how many. I figured most people would probably just leave after I stopped talking. But uh, you didn't do that. So thanks. Appreciate it. Or maybe you just skipped here and now I just look stupid. So.